Are you looking for the next craft beer to try? Well, maybe Young Town by Brew Detroit is the one for you. Welcome back, everybody. I'm Brad. I'm Jessica. We are going to try Yum Town. Have you ever, we've never had anything from Brew Detroit. I didn't even know they existed. We're going to see how they do a really lager cool. with cherries and lime, though. Cool can, though. Yes. Even though it's pretty plain, but yeah. It's got, like, slices of lime and cherries all over it. Well, you'll see the picture of it. Yeah. In the... I forgot to look at the ABV. Um, yeah, I like the, um, it's a very, like, festive. American lager with Michigan tart, cherries, and lime. I'm, like, all things lime right now for some reason in my life. I mean, I'm still a lemon girl, but. 4.7, jeez. 4.7% ABV, 12 IBUs. Yeah, whatever. I can't read that. Uh, it's yep. all right. Let's American move on. Amber slash Red Lager is what they're calling. I'm pretty this. sure that says um, July 26, 18. Okay. Some yeah. of us need to our contacts. Yeah. Other ones do. Um, <laughs> My no head, head went away just like the <laughs> other one. Yeah. Um, kind of white. What bubbles well, watch I do it. have? Watch, watch mine. The bubbles come to the top and then ping. Oh uh, yeah. Oh. Whoa. Wow. Um, golden color, <laughs> like straw, golden, yellow color, mm -hmm. clear. I can see all the way through it. Medium bubble, bubble level in there. Smell that, baby. I will. I could. Okay, smell. Wow. Like, holy Moses. It's almost like Ooh. a lime pop, like yeah, a sweet a lime <laughs> is what I get. I really don't get cherry. Like. It, but lime. It reminds me of something that I've pine. had to drink. It's lime and cherry. Um, not Kool-Aid. What have we had that was limeade? Uh, I've had like cherry limeade. What was it? What did I drink that was cherry limeade? Oh. You're slushy? No. No. I was thinking that the kids had, maybe they were, maybe they were uh, Kool-Aid, like, drink pouches or whatever last year. Yeah. I would but say wow. kind of a sweet tart lime is what I get. Can I drink some of it? I'm, yeah. like, just so excited <laughs> to drink it. God, it's everything it says it is, and that's awful. Too much. That's too much straight up lime. My mouth watered. I don't want to drink any more of it, but I'm gonna. It's, it, it, it smells like it tastes. Wow, yeah. But if anything, in the taste, I do get a tiny bit of cherry. I, I should say fruit, but it's more on that cherry side. I think it is, but that lime is strong. It's almost like a pine saw. It's not quite a pine saw, but whoa. <clears throat> if you are a lime fan, which I am, personally, I think this one's too much. However, wow. And I wonder who in the world would think this would be a good one to sell to the masses. I don't know that I would. I would not be confident in myself to sell this. Well, but like... Are you saying that, but we had the only goes... Go say to, to show? Yeah. It's the best thing I've ever had in my life. But that's... That's totally different. It tastes like salt. Well, yeah, but it's got that lime like this does. It's like a margarita yeah. in a beer bottle. I don't think it's that bad. I don't think that I would drink the rest of this. It is just way too much. I would wow. go 3.75 out of 5. I'm going to go with a three because I don't want to be mean. It's not It's not a horrible tasting beer, but I just, wow. Yeah, you better like lime. 
if you're going to yeah, pick this Yeah, this one. is not one that says lime, and you're like, mm, I can't really find the lime. This one is like, <laughs> holy crap, where are the cherries? <laughs> yeah, yeah, exactly. I don't think it says. Like, it made my yeah. mouth water after but, I drank it, though. But the after, like, after my mouth warms up, it's like a good lime And see, like, taste. my mouth doesn't even taste like anything anymore. Oh. Like, it doesn't, yeah, I don't I have an aftertaste. Like lime. So, if we check untapped, three of my friends have had this, and they average 2.58 <laughs> out of 5. Um, 715 like people have had this, average 3.58 out of 5. Who had it? Just out of curiosity. I was going to look. It's not awful. Nobody we really know. Okay. But it's like, you it, know, it, it, you have to want to like, you have to want to drink lime yeah. juice. And I mean, that's just really what it is. Carbonated lime juice is how I feel. I oh, think, yeah, I, I think if they add in more cherries, my guess is when they made it, they made it. I don't know if they do test batches, uh, but it definitely, for its name, it needs more cherry to I balance so. out that that's, Yeah, that's my opinion, too. But I agree. it's not bad. I could drink it. Would I have more than one? Probably not. But I don't know how many of those lime goes uh, to show... I could drink either. <laughs> but, yeah, definitely. I could drink as many as you could give me. <laughs> it is not the same type of a lime. Well, no, taste. no, but it's. This tastes like lime juice. Yeah, but they use real limes. They blend like I'm just 500 saying, pounds this, and I'm just put saying it in that there. This tastes like carbonated lime juice that you go to the grocery store in the produce section uh, you buy. No. It's like. It's got that lime, but it's got that beer backbone, so you yeah. are getting a little bit of that malt. Yeah. That malt is cutting down, but to me, it's like pine saw, like mm. a, a lime, almost pine mixed together, but that lime is there. So, yeah, if you don't like lime, stay away from it. Yeah, pass. <laughs> but it's good. Yeah. I mean, it's okay, it's not good. I don't think it's, it's good. It's, it's good. a drinkable beer. I don't prefer it. I want to try to be more, like, politically correct here. Yeah. I can quit saying, ew, it's so gross, because that hurts people's feelings that make it. Yep. So that'll wrap up this beer review. Until next time, I'm Brad. I'm Jessica. Happy brewing. If you like this video, make sure you hit that subscribe button and thumbs up, and check out some of our other videos.